Hey everyone, I have part four of my penny haul from the penny list on November 6th and 7th. So if you are interested in what you can find at your DG, then just keep watching. A lot of this stuff is following and it was hidden pennies, which means a lot of people don't know about them. So you might be able to find some of the stuff at your stores even now. All right, guys, let's get into it. If you like penny shopping, couponing, and just saving money in general, then why don't you subscribe? It doesn't cost anything. And if you don't like me later, you can always unsubscribe. All right, guys, let's start with this side. So I found a whole ton of these Easy Squeeze lighters. I found most of these right at checkout, just in their display box still. They do come in a couple different colors. I think I already showed you that blue, and then that pink again. And then I think there's a yellow and a green. Yellow and green. And I think they're all the same UPC. But yeah, those are a penny each, so check your um, check out aisles like right when you're going to the register. You know how sometimes you have a little walkway of just products. Check on the top. Sometimes they're in their regular old display case. All right. So I found a ton of these. Um, they were all on a sky shelf, still in their plastic bag from the factory. So they were never even opened and put out on display. I got a whole bag of them. I have given a lot away already, so I don't have that many to show, but um, I did have a whole lot more. I like to give stuff out, you know, even when I'm in the stores. <laughs> so, I don't know. I just don't like to bring a whole bunch of stuff home because then it's more stuff I gotta put away. Um, and then there's one with like a blue little ring around, and I think it's still the same UPC though. I found one of the lemon napkins. I think this is like the spring, summer, and party. So there is that. I found a bugaboo. I mean, <laughs> a bugable. I call them bugaboos. So there is your UPC for that. And now I have Destiny's Child bugaboo stuck in my head. We got a bunch more beads. Now, some of these you're going to find in that big pink display case. Some of these might be with the regular beads. Um, you're just going to have to scan because they do look similar to the ones that are regular price. And see, this one kind of went everywhere, so I just have to keep it in this bucket. Oh, <laughs> it's coming out even more. But there's that UPC. And then I got this gorgeous clear bin. There is... <laughs> your UPC on that. Now I gotta put all the stuff back in there. Um, okay, so I got this little home sweet home sign. Whoa, throwing things. I'm gonna move over here. All right, so, whoa. I got three of these little planter planters <laughs> planters they are pop shelf so if you see any pop shelf items like with price tags like this i would scan them because a lot of these items are a penny i think i got three or four of these so here's the other two i found one of these little stones for the garden this followed lawn and garden and y'all, if you see in my videos where I'm shopping in store and you see me leaving things, that's because I just don't have enough room and I like to leave stuff for other people to find because if I don't even buy one of the item, that's not gonna alert anyone to it being on the shelf. So just remember that in case you don't feel like taking a whole bunch of stuff home. <laughs> All right, let's keep on keeping on. Here we go. Cherish the good times. This is a little like wooden trinket box. And it was purple dot from last year. And another one. It's the same thing. And I got two of these tray tables. These are blueprints. More beads. This comes with some little charms. 
And more beet. And more beets. And we got some star sticky notes. I love the stationery. I'm so bummed I didn't find very many Jelly Roll pens. That's what I really wanted, but I didn't find much of them. I think I found like two or three, and that's all. This is from S23, purple dot. <laughs> Lucy's playing with beads. It's getting a little bit cleaner in here, y'all. It's a little bit. Um, I grabbed one of these sunscreens. Now, I could have had about 500 bottles of sunscreen, but I learned my lesson when it was my first year penny shopping, and I bought about 100 sunscreens. And don't you know, I still have every last one of them, except for the ones that I donated and gave away for free. Because as it turns out, people don't even want free sunscreen. So, <laughs> I did not grab a lot this year. I just grabbed a couple to give away to friends and family and to just throw in a day bag, you know. Uh, let's see. This little Disney Raya and the Last Dragon toy. Gotta love our penny food. This is the Armor Hot Dog Chili. I grabbed the After Sun Spray. I got a loo for a penny. I'm kidding. I didn't get a loo for a penny. My loo was free. Our neighbor found her on his construction job site, and she was in a wall. I don't know how. She was one lonely kitten found in a wall by herself. So the neighbor brought her home to us in a little bucket with, like, a white T-shirt, and he brought her some food. And, we, hey, bring kittens to my door anytime. You know, I'm going to always take them. <laughs> All right. Stickers. We got some of these puffy stickers. I know my nieces are going to love these, so I'm excited about having these to give them for Christmas. Then there's one that looks like this. Have y'all ever tried that boba tea? That kind of right there with those balls in it or whatever they are, little bobas. I feel like I would probably inhale them and choke, but that's just me. So I don't know if I already showed you these, but there's this one. I'm pretty sure they might be all the same UPC, but yeah, I think they are. And this one is, I think I showed you that one already because of the bobas. All right, these are, I showed you those. I showed you those, I'm pretty sure. I just want to make sure I show you all of them so you know what to look for. All right, so I guess that's all my stickers that I got. Then I got some of the Crayola Mess Free Color Wonder markers. And there's your UPC on that. Now, some of these I did find in the regular, like, book aisle, you know, where they have the coloring book standing up. I found them mixed in there. And then I saw them on some end caps and some side caps. So just look throughout the store, look high, look low, because you never know where you're going to find these items. Another one of the Paw Patrol and another Paw Patrol. Another one of these. I ended up leaving these at stores because I had way too many. So um, these are everywhere. I got some Paw Patrol books. These are workbooks. We got this one. Counting one, two, ten. Hi, Toki! All right. And Alphabet. Oh, sir, please don't start crying. <laughs> Mommy has to keep you out there because you're going to be all over the stuff. Um, so I think these are all the same. Colors and shapes. I think I did that already. Then we got Health Heroes Workbook. And we did Ready, Set, Alphabet. So, yeah, these are all the same. They're just all repeats. Um, but I did get a Crayola Alphabet workbook. And I've been finding these with the regular coloring books um, and down, like, the toy aisle with other sets of Crayola items. So they might be missed. I would definitely check around the store, like, just random areas because you never know where they put stuff. So, I found some more of the Black Paper Party items. This scarf is so beautiful. It's a colorful satin scarf. 
and I have honestly been toying with the idea of buying one because I've heard such good things about satin scarves like when you sleep in satin pillowcases it helps your hair to not break so I'm really happy to have this and try it all right so next this is also part of the black paper party and it says I am the dream and it's this beautiful little notebook it's actually really um, sturdy and made well I like it a lot, but I'm confused because I never saw this stuff in my stores. Um, I only saw that at one store, so I never saw them when they were regular price. I just randomly found some on clearance. All right, I got a whole bunch of these. Don't ask me why. I think this was like one of my first stores and I was scared I wasn't gonna find anything, so I just took them all, um, but I definitely didn't need them all. I will be donating these to church for the ladies who make wreaths and Hey, if you have a kitchen, like Christmas tree, this could be a farmhouse little tree and you could hang these on there. Um, we got Moo. And Cluck. And I think that's it. Oh no, we got an oink somewhere. Oh, I see it, I see it, I found it. We got an oink. So those are kind of cock. Guys, hey, Lulu, why you bite? Lou, be nice to your brother, please. I don't know what she's doing. All right, dude, we don't need these right now, okay, buddy? We're gonna put these away. Oh my goodness, you guys. Um, is this another one or the same? I'm not sure, I think this is the same I showed you a minute ago. I got a whole bunch of these. This is another pop shelf item that showed up in my stores. So if you see these purple squares, I would scan because they are a penny. And this is to hold forks. Oh, and then I got this one and it is for spoons. So like I said, if you see these weird pop shelf tags, please scan because you will be pleasantly surprised. Like I was, I really thought I was being punked when everything I scanned was a darned penny. I guess at that store they had no idea. So that is always fun. Oh, okay, I found it okra. <laughs> Apparently this was in a cup or something. We've got this cute little tea light holder. This is that Shades of Grey collection. This was just by itself on a sky shelf. I don't understand why it was up there, but I'm very grateful. I looked up and I was like, oh, you've got to be kidding me. So I used my little extendo arm and I pulled it out and I caught it. So remember these things. I got these little baking cups, paper treat cups, I guess. I don't think you can bake with these. I'm pretty sure you can like drop your cupcake in it while it's in its own cupcake paper, but I don't think you can bake in those. All right, moving right along. Now I did leave about a hundred of these items at the store because I don't have any use for them. I don't do fairy gnome gardens, but I thought this was adorable as a little miniature. So I'm going to see if my daughter wants it to do something with, <laughs> but yeah, it's a little wheelbarrow. Super cute. Um, what else we got? What else? Not sure if I already showed you this. I think I got a couple of these, so I might have already showed you one. Um, but there's that one. I don't know what I did with the little tag. It probably fell off or the dude ate it because he does things like that. All right, we got these. My first day of school and my last day of school. Little thingamajigs. That's very descriptive, Dana. We got this, my first and my last day of school board. And I got a few of these and I'm gonna probably donate these to church um, for the preschool. Um, so I've got a couple more of those. I have about, I think three or four total or five, maybe, I don't even know. So I also got some more purple dot signs. This is this year's and it is the laundry purple dot. And this is purple dot from last year when it was like the tranquility collection. And I like this one a lot. It is from S23. It was the neutral tranquility collection. Very pretty. All right, let's look at this because I got some stuff in here. 
I found these little sleep shorts. We got this cute little girl's unicorn t-shirt. All kinds of these. I mean, I was finding these left and right, front and center, just all over the place. I think it's because they are not marked with a purple dot, so people don't know. Um, but hey, that's why it's important to scan and just be patient. Spend some time in the store and you will most likely find a penny item. I mean, penny shopping does take a whole lot of patience. So that is something that is important to know because my goodness, when I was younger, there's no way in heck I would have been able to penny shop because I was so impatient. Um, now I get so excited when it's a messy store and I just get to dig through everything. That's my fave. All right, so this is a green dot item, a little caddy. I got quite a few of these little hello signs. These might be cute in a wreath or something like that. Let's look at these rugs that I got because I did get more rugs or doormats, I guess I should say. This one has plants and it just says hello. And there's your UPC. I don't know if I already showed y'all this one, but there's the unicorn one. I might have already shown this one. If I did, I apologize y'all. I'm just, my brain is just bloop right now. Okay, oh, bingo. And then we got this one that says it's a jungle in here, which is pretty accurate with these two. Here is your UPC on this guy. I'm just gonna toss it up. And then I got this leopard welcome mat that I also really like a whole lot. And it is green dot. Watch out, little beast. Oh my God, put this up right there. All right, so let's get this stuff out of here because I already showed you those. It's just more purple dot pop shelf found in regular DG, which is exciting for me because I do watch all of Christy's Connections videos, so I have seen all of her pop shelf stuff, and I've always been so jealous because my store never had pop shelf stuff in it. And I would see other people like, oh, that was in my store, I couldn't believe it. So now it's finally happening for me, and I am super psyched. All right, y'all, I got a little hot dog cooker. This is a little char broil barbecue fork. I got a little terracotta pot. And this is kind of hard to read, but there's your UPC on that bad boy. Then I got um, two two packs of pots. Hi, Lou. Um, I got this little scented candle. I thought it was just citronella, but I don't really know. No, it's not citronella, it's unscented. All right, so what else, guys? Let's see. I found this little chives stone for the garden. This little cute lawn and garden plant. This was following the blue dot toys super stoked about this because I left this in one store because I saw the yellow star and I was like, oh, no way, that's the one. Guess what? It was. So if you're ever in doubt, just scan. Don't listen to your inner thoughts and be like, oh, no, that's not a penny because trust me, sometimes it is a penny. So it's super cute. You might see it that way from the back or this is what it looks like on the side. Bottom. That side sometimes they'll be stored on the sky shelves like this so i want to show you what that looks like and the top of it will look like this just in case they're stacked like that all right i found more beads my nieces are going to be in heaven all right we've got the upc for those i believe these were originally five dollars each so that's a heck of a deal in my opinion and then I got four of these ones, and these have little flowers in them and some like metallic looking letters. And then I got one like this. 
I love these little like clay beads. I think they're super cute. Did I show you DPC? There you go. Let's continue. Now, I found a whole ton of all of these dog flea and tick shampoo things. Or not shampoo. <laughs> flea and tick collars. So, I got quite a few of this size. Oh, upside down, Dana. There goes your UPC for that guy. These are all a penny. Got this one. This guy. I don't think this is a collar. I think this one is the liquid you put on the back of their neck, like in between their shoulder blades so they can't get to it. All right, I think I have two more over here. This is for small dogs. And then we've got this one. <laughs> I did take this even though it was missing the bottom. Um, just because I thought it was cute. And maybe I can like sand this down and use this in the center of something. I don't know. I probably should have just left it. But, you know, I took it instead. I found an old Believe Beauty lipstick. <laughs> I can't believe these are still around. I found so many in the past, and now I'm still finding them. Let me show you one of my favorite finds. I got three of these. These are cute little planters. So you plant your plant in here, and then it ends up looking like their hair. Adorable. Another pop shelf item found at regular old DG. I found three of them, but I just gave one of everything to the cashier because she was just fantastic. And I literally had over a hundred items in my cart. So I was just like, whatever you want, you just take. <laughs> she had so much stuff behind the counter. Her employee was like, uh, do you want me to help you with this? <laughs> All right, so I got this little woodland cottage, live simply beaded garland. The fart noisemakers that are broken. I found these everywhere too. I don't know why, but I did. More of these tags. I got some of these LOL surprise poppies. These are blue dots. Yeah, my nails are dirty. That's gross. Probably because I've been messing around with dirty old penny items. All right, so what else? We have this little Jurassic World poppies. And I was pretty shocked to see, you know, some blue dot items still out that I had overlooked. Um, one of these spin credible candles. I got a whole bunch of Barbie plates and napkins. I just left these out to show y'all because it was getting a little too crowded in here. What? <laughs> Throwing stuff. Alright. I found another blue dot little Spider-Man wand. More pop shelf at DG items. Um, I got about eight of these, I think. I, I don't know why I did that. I think that I just didn't realize I had so many already because trust me, I would have left them had I realized. I have a bajillion over there and I've got to donate them all. Ow. Okay, oh, here was another one of these. And I got another one of those terracotta candles. Unscented, just regular old candle. This cute little Mickey Mouse lawn and garden. Well, this is actually Minnie Mouse. There's that UPC. I did get this green dot plant. It is a hanging plant. This little laundry sign. 
And I apologize if some of this stuff is duplicates, guys. Um, it's kind of hard to remember everything I uploaded. Um, but I try to put the stuff away after I upload so that there's not a mistake and that I accidentally upload more things than I need to. Okay, so let's keep going. Ugh. I got this little purple dot floral arrangement. More beads. Two of our Twilight Forest candles. These followed green dot. I've got this True Living White Musk and Violet candle, and this was Purple Dot. I got this little True Living candle, and it says, Trust Your Ability to Grow. I also had one that said, You Grow Girl, and it was like in blue, I think, but I already gave it to my daughter, so. Uh, this right here, we have got this little artificial wreath. Now, when I worked at Bath and Body Works, we would get stuff like this in, but it was supposed to go around our three wick candles. But here's the thing. This is kind of too up here for me to feel comfortable burning a candle with this around it. I mean, I guess if you pushed it down more, but that's what they were always for at Bath and Body Works. I'm not real sure what they're for at DG, but I mean, it's pretty as long as the candle's not lit because I'm just afraid this is gonna like catch on fire or something. I don't know. Maybe I worry too much. Here is your UPC. I'm running out of room. Look, I, I have no room. I'm just putting stuff behind me when I'm done. Oh God, I'm gonna be cleaning for weeks. All right, we got more of these. I was finding these everywhere too, so I will probably leave these should I find them again. And that's usually what I do, y'all, because if I already have eight of something, what do I need 25 more for? We've got Black Flag Fly Trap. Oh, this way. One penny. And these are the rest of the sunscreens I grabbed. Like I said, I only grabbed around one of each because I went cuckoo caca crazy one year and got like over 100, and then I still have some. Well, uh, more of this. Pretty sure I already showed that. And then this one. Again, after sun spray, I already showed you. And then the sunscreen spray smells like bananas. I mean, I was finding sunscreen left and right, y'all. Like, it was everywhere. I had to purposely just ignore it and walk on by. We got green dots. I think the other one I shared looked a little bit different than that one. Got another one of these trays. The blue dot, or not blue dot, Dana. Blueprints. This is following the blue dot toys. It is a yellow star, My Little Pony. Here is your UPC on that guy. Now again, I left this because I didn't realize that well, actually, I knew, but I was too lazy to scan. Um, all right. I got, whoa, matches. I think I got about six or eight of these. No, six. So, if you see these bad boys, they are one penny. I went back to the store that I left this at last time. Y'all remember when I got like eight from the sky shelf and I just left one because I was like, I can't even reach it. Whatever. It can stay here. I went back to the store and someone had stood it up and put it all the way to the front. So I just got my little extendo arm and got it down. These are still so fun to find. All right. So we have got this cute little green dot plant. We got two little purple dot mugs. I think I found four of these total altogether, but they're just scattered in bags. And this is S24 purple dot. And this is S23 purple dot. Neutral tranquility. Then we've got this green dot. And 
I did leave a lot of these. I left a whole lot of like the Crocs and stuff like that because I, I have too many y'all. Um, I used to go crazy on the vases because everybody leaves them, but now I understand why. There's not very many places you can store these. Um, I got this, it is the Blue Prince Collection. All right, I got three of these silver ones. I didn't need three, all I needed was two. I think I forgot that I had gotten another one at another store and I need to sweep because I have shit all over the floor. Here goes this. So those are all the same. I got one of these like blue glass ones and it followed green dot or it is green dot, not followed. Y'all ignore my bathroom floor. We are in the process of replacing the flooring. So we tore it up and it has like glue on it still. We got this really pretty sign. I might've already showed you. I think I got about three of these. So it could have been in another haul for all I know, but this is the blueprints collection. And one of my faves. <gasps> Do you see this? I got this beehive mirror. It was 20 bucks and I paid one penny. All right, this is what the back looks like. See all the bumblebee prints? And there goes your UPC. All right, y'all, that is all for this video. This was haul number four. I still have five and six coming, so just stay tuned. I will try to get those out in the next couple days. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate each and every one of you. I will talk to y'all later. Bye.